Director of Revenue and Taxation Daphne Shimizu took to the link this morning to get some much needed information out to the people. The economic impact payment program is something that we've been running since about April when the CARES Act was passed. We've made about over 82,000 payments and that equals to about $145 million. Now, it is important to note that for those people who have not filed their non-filer form yet or have not filed a 2018 or 2019 form 1040, you're not going to be eligible to receive a payment this year. For those that are ineligible to receive a payment this year, Director Shimizu says there may be some hope next year if you file the 2020 1040. If you haven't filed, um, unfortunately, you're not going to be eligible to receive a payment in 2020, but you may be able to receive a payment in 2021. Director Shimizu broke down one of the other programs meant to provide financial assistance to families. Another program that we've been running, of course, is the Aduda Imangafa Help for Families program. The program stopped receiving applications on November 12th, and of the some 1,600 applications, the department has made 648 payments, totaling in almost $400,000. Although DRT is no longer accepting applications, for those who made the deadline but are still missing crucial documents, Director Shimizu says to keep an eye out for a notice from the department. Now, it's going to be important that you stay on top of that because you only have a specified amount of time to submit any documents to be able to receive your payment. And once that time lapses, you won't be able to receive your payment. So stay on top of receiving your mail. Make sure you're communicating with us so that that way you can get your Aduda Imangafa Help for Families program payment. And for those still waiting to receive their tax refund... I'm excited, of course, as we've been doing with the Department of Administration, we're scheduled to continue to make weekly payments just as we've been doing since 2019. Those interested in following up with the status of their income tax refund payment can do so by visiting myguamtax.com. Reporting for Guam's News Network, I'm Peter Santos.